Hello everyone, this is Dr. Kanchan. Today we are going to discuss about the introduction to psychopathology. So let's start. So this is the first slide. What is psychopathology? Psychopathology is a term which refers to either the study of mental illness or mental distress or the manifestation of behaviors and experience which may be indicative of mental illness or psychological impairments. The scientific study of mental disorders including their theoretical underpinnings, etiology, progressions, all these include the psychopathology and it is also related to the term abnormal psychology. In the third slide we can see psychopathology the word pathology it is uh, from pathos means suffering and logos means study the study of the essential nature of disease 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 means not at easy something that impairs functioning abnormal away from normality or the normal or average the next slide what is abnormal behavior behavior that is other than normal or markedly irregular not necessarily satisfaction uh, statistically abnormal often just painful or involving suffering psychopathology it is the study of abnormal behavior study of the psychological and behavioral dysfunctions distress and disability such dysfunctions distress or disability itself psychopathology models four main perceptives biomedical views theoretical cause of abnormality there are some uh, causes of abnormality a process similar to that underlying physical illness and the theoretical cure medication or surgery by psychiatry psychiatrist or neurosurgeons like uh, antidepressants electroconvulsive therapy which is also known as ECT insulin shock therapy and surgery etc psychodynamic view theoretical cause of abnormality intral psychological unconscious conflict psychological factors and theoretical cure psychotherapy to develop insights into underlying unconscious conflicts behavioral views theoretical cause of ab abnormality maladaptive learning or faulty habits and thoughts like cognitive behavioral factors theoretical cure learning new response and thoughts usually treated by cognitive or behavioral therapist then comes the stress view which includes the theoretical causes of abnormality it is based on the genes or early learning plus excessive stress uh, period to develop of the disorder which is uh, basically responsible for developing the disorder theoretical cure reduction of stress and learning new coping mechanisms for times stress arises in the future thank you so much everyone for watching this video namaskar